All right, busy, busy Monday morning here. Um, we have two of these big wheels done. There's one in the box, there's one here. Third one is in the oven with the clear coat on it. So we're almost done. Fourth one hanging, already clean, just got a mask, put the plugs in the front, and she's ready to go. So probably before we hit the gym, that will have chrome on it. In my spare time, we've been stripping, and stripping and stripping, so I got the, uh, gas and oil tank for this Harley that we got in the other day. Um, clean them out, a little dish soap and water, so they're good. Uh, these rims got stripped. These parts also go with those big red Jeep wheels. They're stripped. There is a basket of parts in there for the Harley that are getting stripped. And then later on here, we will uh, get in these last couple pieces will go in these forks are going to go in i'm going to try to the guy doesn't want to disassemble them okay so i uh i'm going to try to put them in up to about here so i don't get any acid on this part but i'll strip this whole area on both sets of these um, which will just cut my time down a little bit and then hopefully we'll get that fender stripped and we need to get this bike here washed up and uh, swing arm off of it so that tomorrow we can go to the blasters and get everything blasted pretty quick here and we do have the Lincoln wheels are ready to go um, they just need a final clean a little wipe down and they're good and then this table and chairs goes tomorrow too and that gets second blasted and that'll be ready to go so we got a ton of work um, but hopefully once I get done with these big wheels I should whip through all this stuff pretty quick because it's all pretty easy easy colors most of it single stage stuff um, so there shouldn't be a whole whole lot of uh, issue with it but these big wheels are what's holding me up right now so like I said we're working through it I'm hoping to be done with these tonight if not I will finish them tomorrow afternoon um, but it just takes time so we're moving through it and it's Monday Tyler put together this uh, nice shelf for us here. Kind of help us organize parts. Got a bunch of shit off the ground. Now we got a lot of room for activities here. Great job, Tyler. Yeah, that's it. You do that. Yep. It's activities and stuff. We also have another cart. It's in the back of the truck still, but at least we'll have two for tomorrow when we coat this wheel and that one, and that one's got to be stripped. And then all of this stuff has to be done this week, except for the top shelf. Top shelf's my stuff that we get to when we get to, but we have all of this. Lift kit for a Dodge, Jeep skid plate, diff covers. Uh, there are a bunch of Harley parts in here. What do we got in here? Oh, this is a little Honda three-wheeler stuff. Uh, we got our first set of Brembo brakes, Honda mini bike to do next week, bunch more Harley parts, and a set of 17 inch wheels. Sweet. We totally got this. This is a good problem to have though. All right, great job, buddy. I appreciate it. Yep. All right, cool. So uh, wrapping up another week here. Uh, I'm a little tired. But uh, at least not, I'm going to basically finish up one job today. And uh, so that'll be cool. Get these Jeep parts done. I'm excited for those diff covers to come out because when those come out, I think they're going to be really good. I wiped them down pretty freaking well. So I think they're going to look pretty hot. Um, but other than that, we have a shelf load of stuff. I have three jobs that are going with me and one of the big wheels tomorrow to sandblast which will be cool and then we'll coat tomorrow night 
we're just going to keep doing this and working away and working away. I may hopefully have another business venture meeting this week for something else, but for right now, this is what we're doing and it's working and it's awesome. Uh, but I am going to have to figure out, I think a little different work life balance because I am working a lot. Um, not that that's a bad thing and I don't mind it, but I got to have some time for myself for other things. Uh, and the weather's going to get nice, and I'm going to want to ride this a lot. So, like I said, we'll just keep pushing through and doing what we can, and hopefully here in the next uh, two, three weeks, we get started building this bigger oven, and then we can uh, just keep keep rolling on with that. So, <sighs> yep, I think it's bedtime after this stuff cooks, so it's wrapping up another week here.